Hello, my kindergarten friends. I am so excited that tomorrow is our first day of school. I hope you're excited too. I wanted to share a really special book with you today. It is called The Night Before Kindergarten and it's written by Natasha Wing. Twas the night before kindergarten and as they prepared, kids were excited and a little bit scared. They tossed and they turned about in their beds while visions of school supplies danced in their heads. Erasers and crayons and pencils galore were stuffed in their backpacks and set by the door. Outfits were hung in the closets with care, knowing that kindergarten soon would be there. In the morning it came, school starts today. Would the teacher be nice? Would they still get to play? Faces were washed and teeth were brushed white. Kids posed for pictures with eyes sparkling bright. Parents packed snacks and kids hopped in cars as if they were boarding a spaceship to Mars. Some kids brought blankets or their favorite stuffed bear in hopes they could nap like they did in daycare. Their parents exclaimed, you're big kids now. Let's just hold your bears and blankets for now. The parents were worried their children would cry if they left them at school with just a goodbye. So they told their darlings, uh, if you want, we can stay and make sure that everything will be a-okay. The teacher then greeted each one with a smile, invited the students to stay for a while. The room was all filled with toys, books, and maps. But where were the beds for mid-morning naps? They colored and painted and played, Simon says, then tumbled and skipped and stood on their heads. They sang silly songs from beginning to end. Within just a minute, each kid had a friend. The children were happy. They loved Miss Sunrise. It was she who was in for a giant surprise. When what to her wondering eyes should appear, but sad moms and dads who were holding back tears. <laughs> their noses so sniffy, their eyes red and wet. This was the saddest goodbye Miss Sunrise had seen yet. She gathered the grown-ups on the magical rug, then sent them away after one final hug. The children all wave from the door of the school. Don't cry, Mom and Dad. Kindergarten is cool. And I want you to know that tomorrow you're going to see for yourselves how magical our classroom is and what a wonderful classroom family we will become. And believe me, kindergarten is cool. I can't wait to see you tomorrow.